is our latest piece of weaponry. Um, we bought the Eliminator 3 rangefinder scope just because it just sounded like it was awesome. It can range, you don't have to do any calculations or anything like that, just push a button and you're away. Um, when we first got it, we put it on my A-Bolt 7mm8 and it was, it was alright, but we sort of found we were having a few inconsistencies out past 350 metres and, and it was affected by the wind quite a lot. So then we decided we'd invest in a uh, X-Bolt and this is a 300 Wisdom. We've, we've loaded a handmade 180 grain bullet that doesn't get blown around as much and we managed to get our group at 350 metres to be probably three inches, maybe four inches, three, about three inches, yeah. And um, now we're taking it up for its first seeker trip and uh, hopefully we'll be able to put some animals down with it out at some decent ranges. We've just got into our favourite spot here in the Kaimanawas. Uh, we got dropped in with a chopper and as soon as we got here we realised just how windy it is up on these tops but it's um, supposed to hopefully get a bit better in the next couple of days so we'll try and get into a good spot, set up camp and then as soon as that weather finds out we'll try and get ourselves some seeker. Shoot it. Yeah, one of you guys can shoot it. In the head. I'll shoot it. Yeah, you have to shoot it in the head. We'll go down to where Sam is, okay? Yeah. Oh, it's on to us, stop. It's on to us. Very good. Oh, looked, it looked our way. No, it's not, it just looked at us when you did. Come on, let's go. Don't, don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move. Don't move. Good shot. Right in the head. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Keep an eye out, see if anything else yeah. moves. It's, uh, it looked like it didn't like get it in the cab before the head, but it'll be down for that gun. What nice shooting now, that's what, cool. It's, it's down. down. Dead boy. It's quite quiet that gun, eh? It's kicking around. Drilled it. <laughs> I reckon though. It was right in the head. It hasn't moved. <laughs> awesome. It's wasted it, man. That's what we came for. It's mean off Don't the tripod. It's mean as off the so tri tripod. Grab, go back, grab all our packs. Go to the. Take them to the we'll just chuck the fly over top of it. So the fly's going to get it. And then carry it up to the top. And then get Bingo. Off. It's not going to make a very nice photo, probably. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully, one side's not completely obliterated. It's moving. It's not. <laughs> it's not moving, mate. It's called nerves. It was humane. Humane. Picture one There's out. Only one deer in here too. It's so quiet. That's pretty cool. Congratulations, Noah. 
<laughs> first seeker for that gun. Mm -hmm. Only 180 meters or something, but it's always good to get them in the head. It's never easy, especially when they're moving around feeding and stuff. But mm. pole axe. It's kind of hard, eh? Because yeah. I was like lining it out, just about to pull the trigger. It you, gotta, you, you get better at taking your time when it just it. You know when they stop for a little bit, eh? Mm. When they look up and they stop to have a quick look around. But it's got a really nice skin, so I reckon we should take it off. Are you guys reckon? Yeah. Because it, it's like it's only half an hour back to where the helipad is. We can't so take it off until yeah, the last day. Because we can't leave the meat just. We'll hang the meat. And oh, we'll he might let us. Oh, we'll be able to carry that hull to the top of the ridge. Can you find a real shaded spot, eh? Yeah. Okay. Let's go. rather do this than leave a steak. Stop being a moron. Four pointer, just like no trophy potential on that. It's not yeah. young either. It's old, it's hard as. So that's that's spooky. Put <laughs> <laughs> it on the chin. The here chin we are. Got Noah's deer here. As we as we see him, he hasn't got much potential. We've been here for about. We've seen him three years in a row. Every year, he's been this almost exactly the same. Way. Next year will be all right. Next year will be all right. Every year is the same, and this year. We decided to get rid of him because he's not helping the gene pool much. And he's real close, we'll get the meat off him. And no, I pulled off a beautiful head shot, look at that. Right in the brain. He didn't know what hit him. So that's good. Skin's not as good as we were hoping, unfortunately. Looked good from the top, but he's been rubbing on all these trees and stuff. And as you'll see in the video when he's feeding, he's just picking away at all these berries. There's heaps of berries around, so that's why they're out on these tops at the moment. But we'll um, get this meat off him, get the guts out, and it's quite big, yeah. keep moving. Yeah, he's a big, pretty big animal for around it's here, anyway. Cheese. 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 <clears throat> it's first thing in the morning here. We got that deer the other day, and now we're ready to go after a bigger one. Hopefully, it's pretty, pretty nice day. We weren't expecting it to be this nice, so we should definitely get a good one today. Probably not. <laughs> we should definitely get one that probably not. Definitely maybe. 60-60. <laughs> it's split game 60-60. Sure. Oh, Nice shot. <laughs> <laughs> nice shot. Nice shot.
sucks with that headwind, eh? Not sure if it's going a little bit to the side or not, but I'm just no, dropping like down here now to get this deer. That Harry shot. It took us about half an hour to get here, but that's it doesn't matter, it won't be going anywhere, so we'll just drop down and see if we can find it. Looks like a nice eater that one, doesn't it? It's a good eater. 300 meters. Yep, a bit of wind too, so it's a pretty good shot really. Wasn't exactly where I was aiming, but it's dead, so it's a good thing. Yeah, it didn't get far. Got some meat for yep. camp, camp for the rest of the trip, and that's always pleasing. Yep. The old eliminator, 300 wisdom, does the damage. Second seeker deer down. <laughs> Camp set up. Ready to slay some deer. I've already slayed two of them. Harvested two. We just up at our flight camp here. Well, it's just 30 meters over the hill there. And we're sitting down here. We've been glassing for probably three hours and we've spotted one deer just down here about. 350 meters he's a hind just laying down in the at a bit of a clearing in the bush and then another another two deer way off in the distance there and then if you come further out to the right we spotted another hind about a kilometer away but with them not worth going after today and they're just hinds so we're just sitting here enjoying the evening watching them and hopefully a stag might poke its head out later on but we're just gonna sit and wait and see what happens. Yeah. It's about six o'clock and it's freezing. Um, we're glad we, we we're just doing this little message to Mum because she would not enjoy this. You can see your breath and it's gonna supposedly there's gonna be um, gale force winds 130k an hour and we're under a fly that is. Um, Definitely not equipped to it's handle held, 130 it's, kilometer it's winds. It's held up by a rotten log. So we're just going to do a couple of Hail Marys tonight before we go to sleep and just go to sleep and leave it till the morning and hope that it's all still standing. But chances are it's not going to be. But he's, he's hoping, his dad would say. <laughs> Biff a couple of Hail Marys out there, you reckon? Are you warm now in that hat? Leggings, you got full leggings. My knees are still cold though. Same. My knees are numb. 
because these are like real open, I think the ears goes up. Yeah, I might have told as well. Hmm, the Mylads are nice though. Warm up our bellies before we go to sleep. Oh, some rock there. What's going on? It's too cold. I'm trying to get warm. Oh, look at that. What is that? The sky. Oh, the sky. Yo, Did you? Oh. <laughs> Just glad I'm not sleeping in your tent tonight, mate. You didn't, eh? Yeah, feel it. That'd be a weird What one? The big one. The big one. Just. I thought you were in the tent. It's a little duet by me and Noah. Should we do a few inquiries? Keeping occupied. Yeah. We had an inquiry last night, eh? We had an inquiry <laughs> from a seeker. A seeker. Going psycho. Psycho. Whistled for like 20 minutes. I was just thinking, oh, that's scaring every deer in the valley. We've just been listening to the. Uh, hang on, hang on. We just listened to the weather forecast on our little radio here, and it's supposed to get better by about lunchtime today. Clear out, says fine. So um, we're pretty excited about that. It's been the only highlight of the day so far. That and um, eating a few jelly beans. But now we're uh, getting ready for a hunt. We'll start. We'll start packing in a little bit, and uh, you can already see a bit, bit lighter out here. So, fingers crossed. In another hour or so, we'll be bowling some deer over. It's going down the hill, watch it. It's that one that's going down. Take him again. Where is he? Just he's down from where it was. It's run, just running. No, that's the other one. It's just ran past. Yeah. Yep, you got him. Got it again. Yeah, I'm just it. sitting yeah, there. It's down. The young two are just chilling with the baby. The baby even stood up. It's down. It just died then. You two are just lying there. Look at the one running across. Yeah, yeah, that's I am. Just waiting for it, healing it. It's dead, that one that you shot. Can you see it? Yeah, it just died then. Felt like a good shoulder shot. A bit low. Those are two just chilling. Hello, baby. Imagine if you needed some meat, eh? Just a waste place of them. Oh, the baby one just died. It's so cute. It's just a juvenile. 
Okay. Is the other one waiting for its baby? Yeah. They're a bit annoyed, huh? They don't even hear it really though, don't they? No, they just think it's done there. Good shot, Sam. It was... New record? 353 metres. No, it wasn't a record. 370. What? 370. I think that's the whole I'm doing that. Yeah. God, they're stupid. Okay, it's we need to get going. Take some photos of the baby room. I want to get them running off. I still haven't heard the rock yet. Oi! Back her up! Oi! Shh! Looking up at us now. Go away! Not behind. They're uh, yelling us. Can you hear that? You think that was a stair? Yeah, there they are. There's three there. Yeah, the baby the one. Baby. It is cool. This is this uh, young deer I just shot. As you see, he would have been a little wee spiker this year. But he'll be delicious eating. In pretty good nick. And you can see up. We shot him from right up there. I'm not sure if the camera's picking it up, but it's pretty much directly downhill. And I got him exactly where I was aiming. In that shoulder there. I don't know if you can see that, but there's the hole just there. Exactly where I was aiming, 370 meters. That gun's pretty well sighted in. Gotta love the eliminator. Even allows for angle that you're shooting on and everything. But we'll get the meat off that as quick as we can and get back to the helicopter. Okay, well we're at, at the landing pad here waiting to get picked up. Had a bloody awesome trip. Um, the gun has more than outdone itself. Got some, pulled off some reasonably good shots. Next time I think we'll have to go real push the boundaries and try 600, 600 meter shot I think, but um, for what we've done it's proven itself to be spot on and uh, we're all real happy with the trip. driving out, it's been an awesome trip, we've seen 30 deer, took 4 so there should be plenty left there for next time.